cutest newest collection from the summers and spring summers collection so i'm basically this is number 25 pure white and i did two coat already and you're on matte top coat for that? And I am on the matte top coat. So what I'm going to do, I am going to kind of like draw it as the chevron. You can do it with chevron. You can do it in like a French look, however you want. I'm going to like doing it once right from the edges down. And then you can go from there. Don't worry about this. We're gonna just, you know, using it brush number four and kind of perfect your smile like. Just a little bit of teal on that plate. And submerging that really a thin and precise bristle. And we are gonna keep keep your um one of your fingers on your painting. I mean, on your dominance hand, whatever the hand that you're painting, it's connecting with the others. So then you can have a lot of support, which is that it means it's just the purpose of it to keep your hand, your finger from um, getting shaky when you're doing it, because it's have more support on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you just have to stabilize your stroke. So doing the same thing when you're even doing using the um, nippers for your manicure or for your pedicure service, especially for a lot of beginner. Um, and then same thing with e-file, with anything that you are going to do, you will find it. It's a lot of unique, like, same techniques like that. All right. I am going to gear this for 30 seconds. No need to be perfect because we're going to do another layer with the um, cat eyes. You can now you can do any base it doesn't have to be pure white you can be beige you can do earthly you can do any colors like on um, nights light nude and base nude any colors you want to do in the background it doesn't have to be just the pure white you can do milky white you can do any colors that you want on the background this one i have beige on it on my nails so either way so this is this are two cuties right here we're gonna do the third nails it's so cute and it looks like really it looks so easy to do and you feel texture but you don't feel it's, it's catching anything at all this is so cute it's perfect like all right so i'm gonna using number 39 aqua blue from a cat eye gel collection and i'm gonna go ahead and fill in the seam as a friend that i have for my teal i love the give it a little bit background but you can use jade you can use any colors underneath it's up to you all right so now if you now if you don't want any effects on the cat eyes leave it alone here you're good to go but if you want some like just a little effects on it then i'm gonna using a cut eye too and then give it like a 45 angle can you see mm -hmm. yeah, can, can you see it's cool huh okay. and i'll cure one straight oh it looks good it looks better and i want i don't know it's just too bright right now and it's okay it's okay you gotta see in person when you get okay cure for a flash cure for 30 seconds and then we are going to use uh, this Japanese. Now you can do any. Um, so a lot of you are getting a different color on this. In the sub box, I get this colors on my sub box. Well, a lot of you are getting a pink. And a lot of you get um, yellow. Maybe we should do yellow. You can do any color. I can do yellow. A lot of you getting yellow. A lot of you getting a pink. A lot of you getting... Um, Purple, a lot of you getting 
purple, blue, black, white, whatever color it is. Get the dress if you any colors you get, we will work perfectly with a smiler. Yeah, it's gonna be so stunning. I'm gonna use a yellow. Let's see how yellow is gonna turn out. And then it's really with the precision brush. If you don't have a brush number four. I'm gonna start right in the middle and then just really gentle. You don't have to like press it so heavy handed. Okay. I know the pink it looks good on this, but you can do any colors. I'm just gonna do is the yellow, just for a lot of you are getting yellow, but you can do any. However, if you do a base as a background, if you're doing the beige colors or kind of a pink color, you can definitely use the white. Uh, gel painting just really depend on what base that you are going to get but doesn't matter what base you are getting it's gonna be so beautiful okay keep it like parallel with the nails and it's really gentle and then try. okay just like so. all right here for uh 30 seconds flash gear doing like a time and then we're gonna do like phone care when you will complete all right so going to the conical gels again and then which flowers should we do just flowers or just flowers yeah, the color, huh? okay. the color. i'm having fun with this i'm having fun with this because this has so many it's all different frame, all different fillers, crystals, and and so on. So lots. And we also get to give your love equally. Oh. I'm just making a mess with this one. How dare am I? All right. Okay. So, I'm go ahead and using condensable gel. For all of you just tuning in, I am using the three-step method. So, if you already have a brush and crystal picker, the best you can do for yourself a favor is getting your uh crystal trifecta the, it that one of the best thing the best investment whether you are doing it for yourself or getting it for your business for your salon for your suite it definitely will get you every single time back you up every single time and with your investment all right, so I'm going to apply is um, untie the nails. Well, if you know exactly where you are going to, you can definitely apply in that spot. But then, then make sure you cover it all because then sometimes the client change their minds. You can't just using the top coat and put crystal on because the crystal or the beads will definitely going to fly off the nails in like a couple hours. It like staying right there when they, you know, they're with you and taking picture. But when they get home, they're going to be so disappointed because it's, oh, I didn't know the crystal would stay there. But then you can't blame on the clients at all. You shouldn't add more crystal, you know. There's more crystal is more more um, excitement and then more, um, I would say, the ticket, like higher ticket you get. So just I always getting whole entire the client's nail. And then the, the condensable gel is really thick density. So you don't need a, like a whole bulk load to get it on so um you can get a really nice good layer of it and then it will cover how entire the design so i ha i always doing it like this designs and then clients like nancy can you add more you are never gonna say no and you don't want to have to go back and put the top the condensed blue gel right on the top of the top coat you just finished right so it's make it like just like really a lot of uh, flaws around the crystal so you want to make sure that you cover how entire the nails and you don't have to do a really thick layer so it doesn't take a lot of your condensed blue gels but it's always get um you know you and um, back you up every single time your clients want more crystal and more designs on it like oh can you add some frame on it the frame can't not hold with just only precision glue gel or top coat it need the bestie condensed blue gels so now if you can continue doing it cuties and stuff like here if you want to i'm gonna do i'm gonna do this one though which one should i do oh my goodness should i do this should i do this you can do white or you can do matching color kind of matching kind of matching matching mm -hmm. 
And yeah, so currently we can only ship to US, Canada, and Puerto Rico at the moment, and Mexico. But yes, we will let you know when we can ship international again. Should be very soon. Please stay tuned. Where are we? Alright, so I'm gonna leave it right there. I like to add some a couple of my cutie from the crystal kit ultimate crystal kit number one is back more in the stock now so grab them okay, oh my god what can I do with this pink one hold on It's not only have one color, it has like 20 different colors, different sizes and a different um, color. So you can have so many of ideas to create like limitless of your crystal designs. That's it. I want just two of them right there. Maybe three. I think it's just the edges. It's good like that. Hey, if you want more, I'm not gonna stop you. I was like, do it. Looks good, huh? Always cover the line of the yellow, though. It's okay. I love this. It had everything. It had frame. And it had all the beads, all the frame. I need it. And here's a really cool thing. A best thing about the condensed glue gel and no wipe top coat. Make sure make sure you give it like when you place them on, give it a little bit like pressure down. Just don't let it floating on the top. You need it to be like ankle down. So then that's why it was like bonding right into the condensed glue gels and no wipe top coat. With this is the little I'm gonna put this on one beat. You can do two, three, four, five beats, however you would like. You do what make you happy and make your clients happy. You can kind of see that the condensed glue gel and no wipe top coat it definitely is really like wrap the base of the crystal in the flower so so well. Alright, so that's it. I am going to give it a quick flash here. 30 seconds. You want more things on it? I'm going to do some beats on it. Alright. And for the beats, I'm going to pick up some of the condensed glue gel because the beads is staying on the flowers. I'm going to do it to condensed glue gels. I'm not going to use it with the top coat because top coat, as I said again, is not going to hold it really well. So we want some condensed glue gel. So here is get close up of 20 colors. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Three times sold out with this kit. So if you don't see it, probably because you haven't seen it. But three times. Grab yours because it's going to definitely is created so many of these eyes for you. And it does all the work for you. Every single client. I mean, every single design or the clients that want it, you are that, that. At least it's 20. And then this is another kit that's a sister or brothers. It's Ultimate Crystal Kiss number two. Also have a lot of frames, a lot, a lot of frames, and there are 20 different colors. I love a lot of them. Each of them have a different like combination. So then you have like total 40 colors at, that you are going to use. And then also one of my really uh, favorite one as well, it is the, uh, where is that at? Um, ultimate crystal perfect combination where's my combination kit this might be over there 
all right so this one is done in the meantime i'm grab my combinations i have like two combinations yeah this is the combinations right there and it's mean that it's had not only the colors of it the ss filler is also have a compatible and a matching the centerpiece so then you not only have a colors that you love you want your clients love and clients want and you have a centerpiece so if you have to pick two things i mean one thing for crystal i would pick this kit i love all the kids and of course my glow in the dark is my favorite kit but you know this just trying to listen really really like trying to listen to all the nail takes now lovers and then definitely would love to fulfill and it's always getting better and better to improve it for your needs and you don't have to get everything to break your bank in order for you to have everything you want you can definitely have at least this one of the kids had everything you want centerpiece you see so a lot of designs are using a centerpiece from the kit and also a crystal trifecta so you have this two this kit and crystal trifecta they are definitely is going to really like a sparkle and shine your crystal designs and also is the long lasting the crystal um let go into this one when i am gonna add a couple i'm gonna using just the the dot two and then give it just a little bit right there just right in the beads now i don't want it just to just last for the picture i want the clients my clients your clients to have a beautiful design and absolutely enjoying it not only a moment of picture also it's gonna last so long so i'm gonna go ahead and use just a little dot of the no wipe top coat but i'm gonna put it right here so i'm gonna dot it right on the top because the same concept we're doing with the to cover it so then between the condensable gels and the wet top coat it will definitely grab the base of the beads oh hold on i want a bigger one i want a bigger beads for the bigger flowers she's running out oh so cute just cutie right there and that's it. Flash key it quick. Yeah, any more you done? Uh, I'm gonna do precision glue gel after that and it will be done. But I'm gonna flash key it so then my beads will not running anywhere. It's gonna stay in one place. I'm gonna wipe off my plates. And then precision glue gel. Of course, do not lose this red cap. I put always put it on the side. So whenever I finish, I'm closing it up. It's just keep it from getting clogged on that nostrils right here. Also, it keep it really nice and protect your uh, precision glue gel from getting spills or um, anything. During some time, we like busy with clients and the station can be a, you know, cluttery and a mess. So you don't want to... Um, miss and losing that red cap so i'm gonna go ahead and do it some exam usually i'm using a whole and tie that precision glue gel without squeeze anything out yet so i'm gonna just like squeeze it first and seals all the beads if you have a frame we're gonna seal the frame and beads so i'm gonna show you how much i need that much you see that how it's just little that's all i need but i'm not gonna squeeze it out yet i'm gonna go and get into the beads and frame and then we're gonna seal it first, seal first, seal completely them first. Make sure they are not only seals to prevent from getting tarnished, also they are going to like really stay concrete on the client's nails. So I'm gonna, now I'm gonna go check, check, check. If you feel scratchy, you're gonna squeeze just that much. Little will go a long way just in case you need to go back again. Feel free to key it for 30 seconds so then that way it's set. It's kind of set for your first layer and then you can seal it again because to avoiding too much precision glue gel at one time. All right. I am going to go ahead and cure, full cure for 60 seconds and this now will be completely done.